Bitcoin is going on a run right now and we have to talk about what the potential targets are here. We should also not disregard that this is a weekend rally so we have to look also at the volume to see if that is really a legit pump here and I found some interesting signs that give us quite a good understanding where will uh, we be heading next and uh, we're also going to talk about some altcoins so definitely stick around here make sure that you're subscribed to the channel like this video for the algorithm and also um, activate the bell so that you will never miss out on these important updates and now let's directly get here into the charts today so we saw here on the four hourly chart Bitcoin forming uh, this falling wedge here that we just broke out of today to the upside and now we are running into this resistance area here of 20, uh, $28,093. We were just rejected from there while we were, we were trying to push above that. So and that of course, oh, I have actually to, um, actually it was a little bit higher. Sorry, I moved the line here a little bit. So actually all the way up there, I think here where the entry was. Yeah, so there, sorry, it's at $28,315. So that's um, the resistance where we got now slightly rejected from. And it is also the entry target of our potential long position if we can close a four hourly candle above that level. So um, the short scenario is still in play here, in my opinion, because what we could see is that we just pump here um, for another five and a half hours. So that means also the next candle could go up here, um, potentially breaking through 28,300. So, but then we could see a fake out where we roll over and then we come all the way down here. So, and then we get our entry because if that level here is breaking at 2793, then we definitely go lower. So that is something that we have to be aware of. But I found something on a higher time frame that might uh, contradict that and that is on the daily chart. So here on the daily chart, um, we see right now a morning stop pattern here evolving and that is uh, consisting these three candles where we see in the initial move of that uh, candlestick pattern, a candle to the downside then a doji candle and then the third candle moving to the upside. So if we can close at least at $28,200, $300 or even at $28,350, then this is a reversal pattern back to the upside. And we might see then also indicators turning around here uh, like the stochastic RSI uh, that is definitely here in the cards right now that we see here like a small pinch like that after today's uh, daily close here where we then go sideways up until we get here a bullish cross again and that could lead to a further pump into Monday, Tuesday and also uh, Wednesday. So and of course also the, um, the RSI, once the RSI makes a higher high here, uh, let me just make this a little bit more clearer. Let's get rid of this one here. Uh, you see already the RSI wants to turn around. Once the RSI is breaking this high point here, this one, the bearish divergence will be invalidated. So, and it looks like it, if we continue to push it to the upside, that that might be the case and the bearish divergence will be invalidated and Bitcoin will go higher and higher. So that is something that we have to be aware of. So, and I told you guys that I'm also looking at some altcoins. Um, so I am myself trading link right now. So, and why do I trade link? Because I had told you guys that when we come back into this green area here, that is my buy zone, that I am going to buy there. So, and that's exactly what I did, guys. You can see here on my buyback account, I'm up almost $2,500, 48% on this position that I took here on LINK. It was already over $3,000 earlier, but uh, because Bitcoin is going down, LINK is going down. So you see uh, my calls are definitely working out here. 
And um, if you don't have a Bybit account yet and you want to trade with me together, then you still get a $30,000 bonus if you sign up with my specific link here or on BitGet $20,000 also only with that link. The links are in the pin coin below and in the description below, guys. So now let's talk about a little bit more about altcoins. So here on the Bitcoin dominance, um, I think if we don't see a push by tomorrow here above 47.8%, percent on the Bitcoin dominance, we could see a double top formation. So where here was the first top and here's the second top because that is a lower high and that could be the start of the altcoin season if it turns out to be like that. So we have to wait for tomorrow to see confirmation where we break further to the downside here on the dominance. But if that's the case and the, today's candle is not flipping green and trying to push here higher because Bitcoin might go on a tier, then that's what we are uh, looking forward to. So and then I want to show you something here on the total two um, on the uh, altcoin market cap excluding Bitcoin on the two weeks chart. So every time when we had a falling wedge on this chart, at some point the altcoins went absolutely ballistic and the total market cap also increased tremendously. And that is exactly uh, the point where we are potentially are right now because compare here this falling wedge to this one here. So we got here a massive pump to the upside once we were breaking out of it. We are out of it now. So we could see in the next two weeks a crazy pump here to the upside. So here also falling wedge consolidation within that falling wedge breakout massive run to the upside. And the same down here consolidation massive run to the upside. So that is also something that I'm watching closely and you should actually too look at the screen, stop the video, redraw it and watch it, watch what's happening. So if we see here a, a break above $621 billion in market cap and we go higher, then this break is confirmed and um, then we know where we are heading to and the altcoin season is then definitely confirmed. So definitely look out for that guys. And this two weeks candle is closing in around nine, nine and a half hours. So we have to watch the next two weeks candle what's going to happen there but I believe this will be a really really good one guys that's it already for today's episode please make sure that you smash up the like button hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell and I'll see you then again